Direct outputs are an assignable resource. Direct outputs and mix minus outputs share a pool of 188 resources. To allocate a direct output to a channel or group, tap the Direct Output tab and select the required width. The number of remaining resources is displayed underneath. Once created, the width of the direct output can be changed in the control window header. Tapping No Output will remove the direct output. The direct output controls include the Send Level, AFL and Output Listen, which is similar to AFL but the feed is taken post-output delay. There is also a talkback control and send position selector. If a surround path has a mono or stereo direct output, you can choose whether it follows the downmix level or if each leg will be summed at unity. Pre-fader direct outputs can be set to follow spill fader levels if you want the balance of the legs to be maintained, but don't want the overall fader to affect the output. The Tone button injects tone to the direct output. The patching area displays the destination to which the direct output is patched.